Hello guys, how are we all? So, uh, I hope you know what has gone on in the last week. You may well have seen on the old socials that I'm a dad now. Uh, yeah, very exciting. Um, but everything's gone super well. Uh, but there's a darts tournament on tonight. We were just at Bob's mum's house and she's all chill. And she was like, do you want to go home and do a stream? And I said, you know what? Instead of a stream, what I might do is I might go to a darts tournament. So there's a, there's a darts tournament tonight. It starts in, I mean, what's the time? It starts in about two hours and it's going to take me about 45 minutes to get there. So I just thought that'd be a good little bit of practice. So I need to just make sure I've got everything that I need. Um, I've got two sets of darts. I've got spare stems, spare flights, that'll do. Entry power, entries are fiver, which I've got. Um, yeah, let's go and play some darts. Um, so we're basically, we were gonna do a stream, well, I was gonna do a stream, but then I thought we might as well just go play. Might as well go get some practice in. Um, <clears throat> me and Ash, well me, I am playing in the Modus Influencer. I'll put it in quotation marks. I know people, people aren't a big fan of the word influencer. But I'm playing in the Modus Influencer Charity Tournament in two weeks today, I think. It's the 14th today. 14th? No, it's 14th tomorrow. Today's Saturday. Two weeks tomorrow, and I've not really had much practice this week. Luna, you gonna come? She's just chilling down there. Luna, you come in. Come on in, let's go. Uh, I've not had much practice this week, obviously, because I've been busy having a child. So, I thought... Seeing as Bob's is chilling, she's at her mum's, Winter's chilling, uh, she's at her nanny's, obviously, at the same place, and um, they're all happy, and I thought, you know what, I need to kind of practice playing darts without a drink, because if I want to play darts in, like, the summer league and stuff, I'm not going to be able to have a drink, I'm going to have to drive, because I can't expect Bob's to, Bob's and Winter to come pick me up every single Friday, so... We're going to have to drive for the Summer League, so I thought, we'll try tonight. We'll try and play darts without a drink. Since I've swapped left-handed, I'm a lot more confident. I don't, I don't feel like I need the alcohol like I did before. So it's going to be interesting to see how this goes. Hopefully it goes absolutely fine. It'll be nice to see a load of people as well. I'm sure they'll all be happy to see me as well. Um, but I think I've got everything. And, yeah, let's go. I need to get some fuel, need to get something to eat, and then we're going to go play darts. All right, all I'm missing now is a dart shirt. Uh, I think I've got a pink one somewhere so i'm gonna wear a pink one tonight obviously winter we've had a girl we're doing the pink um and yeah let me find a pink t-shirt pink dart shirt and then we'll be heading off <coughs> that is the shirt of choice for today so let's get it on loopy give me a kiss Mwah. You'd be a good girl. I'll see you in a few hours. So Bob's sister's actually going to come over and grab Luna in a bit. So she won't be left alone on her own for too long. I don't like leaving her on her own for too long. She is very good. She's very well behaved, but it's been a bit of a weird time for Luna. She's been so good with the baby, though. Like, so good. But to the point where she's almost like... It's almost like she's being a bit too cautious. Um, which is great. But at the same time, she's a bit like nervous and stuff. It's almost like she doesn't know what she's allowed to do. And which is obviously a good thing in, in a sense because she's so gentle with the baby. But also because she's so gentle with the baby, she's like scared to even go near the baby. Like she's given the baby a few kisses and stuff and she likes to snuggle near the baby wherever we're holding her. But she's been good. She's been very good, haven't you, Luna? She's been very, very good. Right. Let's go. I'll fill you in on what happened and what's going on with the motor stuff in the car. Okay, so tonight's tournament is just a, it's just a straight knockout, five pound entry, best of five, 501. That is it. It's not like a round robin. I'm probably realistically gonna get one game of darts tonight, but it's a good place for me to have a little practice because obviously with all the baby stuff that's been going on, I've not really had a practice. I had a little throw last night, which was lovely. Missed a few 80s, which is great. Um, so obviously still playing left-handed as well. So we'll be playing left-handed tonight, obviously. And yeah, it's just gonna be like a good little bit of practice tonight. See some people, which will be absolutely lovely. And yeah, I'm looking forward to this. So this should be should be a good, good, good night of darts. Whether we win any games or not, 
I don't really care. It's all good practice and I need it at the moment because we do have the, uh, the modus thing coming up. So let me fill you in on that. So the modus influencer, we'll put it in quotation marks for anyone who gets upset about the word influencer. The modus influencer charity event is uh, two tournaments. It is a pairs tournament with a pro player. I'll probably put that in quotation marks as well just to make sure no one says, oh, they're not a pro, they're not a pro. Relax, guys. It's just a tournament. It's just a little bit of fun. Um, <clears throat> so it's two tournaments. It's a straight knockout between the influencer people, the social media guys, and it's a straight, and then it's a pairs tournament where the social media guys are paired up with a pro player. Now, one of the pro players on the list for this is a guy called Ashley Coleman. You might have heard of him. You might know who he is. If you've watched this channel, it's a good chance you know who Ashley Coleman is. So the Modus people contacted me and said, look, do you want to play? Would you be? Would you have any interest in playing in this influencer thing? And I was like, yeah, I actually would. Because I didn't really know if, if I would be able to because of the birth of the baby. So the baby's due date is actually not until like, it's in, it's in, it's in three days. So obviously the baby was early, but I wasn't sure. I didn't know if it would be like too close to the baby's birth to be able to play in it. But because the baby was born a few days ago, uh, I'm fairly confident that Bob's will be able to cope. And she's got my mum and dad, she's got her mum and dad, she's got her stepdad, she's got all of her sisters. Like, she'll be able to cope for a night, even if they stay around. We've got spare rooms and stuff. So she'll be fine to cope for that for that one night without me. She'll, she'll be absolutely fine. She'll have all the support in the world. So I thought, you know what? So yeah, Bob's will be absolutely fine. And I thought it's only gonna come around once every, potentially every year, maybe not even that. So I thought this is this is one, one chance to go and do something really cool. Just go and do it. So there's a lot of people in the in the tournament. The influencers is like Pie Face, who you probably know, Finn Galdins, um, Charlie Murphy is in it, uh, Carl, Cole Anderson, I think his name is. I, um, there's a few other people in there. I'm sorry, I've probably missed some people as well, so I do apologize. Um, but yeah, there's a few decent people in there. There's a few people who I know, who I've watched before, which is cool. Go and meet all of them. So yeah, one of the pro players is Ashley Coleman. And, uh, and once they confirmed that Tom Garrett had dropped out, um, then they were like, look, do you want to play? I said, yeah, sign me up. They said, okay, we'll announce it in the next, next couple of days. And uh, yeah, I'm in. So we're, we're playing in the, in the Modus Influencer charity event thing. Um, but one, one thing of the tournament is that it's a pairs tournament with a pro player. And I was like, look, I, I don't know if you can fix it. I don't know how you do it. Just please, please, I just want to play pairs with Ash. Like, there's so many good players in that thing. I, I'm sure I could do well with, with any of them, but I just, I want to play with Ash. That is what's going to mean the most to me. It's going to be the most fun for me to do. So the original plan, I think, sorry, Mode, if I'm lifting the veil a little bit too much here, um, but the original plan was just to do a random draw and see who gets paid with who. So realistically, one in eight chance that I get Ash, which, you know, it is what it is. It, it, it would have been fine if I didn't play with Ash, but I did want to play with Ash. And then they, and then I had a DM from them. And they said, check our last tweet. I was like, right, okay. So I was, I was cuddling the baby. Um, sat on the sofa and I saw the tweet and it said you guys choose who plays with who and I was like well that's it then it's going to be me and Ash there's no way me and Ash don't get voted together so the, the vote went up me and Ash by an absolute landslide like it was it was it was never in doubt so yeah it's going to be me and Ash are going to be playing together in this influence of pairs thing which I can't wait hopefully he'll be here tonight actually I've not seen him since the birth so hopefully we'll be able to see Ash tonight which will be lovely um, let me fill you in on the birth and everything so Bob's went in on Monday, today's Saturday. Bob's went in on Monday for a scan. She went in for a scan, that was it. It was a week before her due date or eight days before her due date. Um, and it was just a scan to make sure everything was progressing fine. Uh, and everything was okay. And anyway, after the scan, fast forward 36 hours, we had a baby. <laughs> so uh, the scan basically just said, look, we, we need to get the baby out probably sooner rather than later. So let's make a plan. And let's let's suss it out. So yeah, within 36 hours of Bob's having a scan, I was a dad. I became a dad. Uh, I I absolutely loved every minute of it so far. Um, it's been we had one tricky night. The first night was a bit tricky, but because we weren't prepared for a baby to come home, the house wasn't really warm. The house was just like normal. I mean, it's it's April. It's it's not it's not cold, but it's not hot in the house. We don't have the heating on because it costs a bit, quite a bit where we live. The heating's like ridiculous. So we come home the first night and the house was a little bit cold and like the baby did not like the cold house. So the first night was a bit tricky. Um, but after that, I mean, Thursday night, Friday night, today's Saturday, absolute perfect. 
two feeds in the night, no problem. Two feeds, two nappy changes, two cuddles in the night, perfect. Uh, really, really simple. And then basically what, what Bob's has been doing is I've been doing the night stuff and then Bob's has been waking up at like six, seven. This morning she, she woke up herself at quarter past seven, which is like unbelievable. <laughs> That's a really good lay-in, actually. Um, so she woke up herself at quarter past seven, and then Bob took her downstairs, um, and then I had a couple of hours of sleep while she was looking after her downstairs. And yeah, we've got a li nice little routine, nice little plan. It's all coming together quite nicely. Um, and yeah, it's been really good. But anyway, that's enough waffling. Uh, let's go get to this darts tournament. Here we have. Rogue Ashley Coleman in the wild. <laughs> Look, he's fighting me a lot. Yeah. <laughs> So, the day has come. The darts referee must play against the pod squad. <sighs> well, I can't say it went particularly surprising this game, to be completely honest. Uh, Ash, actually, to be fair to him, he, he showed me no mercy, which is good. It's very good. Uh, it's good for his career. It's good that he's not looking at his friends as people he should be giving a chance to because he gave me absolutely no fucking chance in this game. The first leg, he left 50 after 12, he went out. The second leg, he went out in 15. The third leg, he actually missed a couple of darts at a double here and there, um, and he caught, He let me get down to like the 200s, which was really nice of him, so thanks for that, Ash. Um, but yeah, he played really well. Um, it's, always, it's always nice to play against Ash, because I know what to expect from him. I know how to play against Ash, and to be honest... Because he's the only person I actually care about. He's the only person I actually want to see win. So when I'm stand when I'm standing behind him and I've gone eighty five ton eighty five and he's gone one two one one forty one two five, I'm like, yeah, good stuff, mate. I love it. I do love it. Obviously, I never I never want to lose. I never want to. I never like losing. But sometimes it's not the end of the world. Uh, but yeah, he played really well. He didn't go on to win this tournament, unfortunately. But he did play well. And I must admit, if he keeps doing what he's doing, he's going to become massive. He's going to be such a big dart player, and he's going to be so good. He's he's just growing and getting better and better all the time. And um, yeah, I can't wait to play the modes with him. I think we're going to absolutely smash this. Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me. Um, it's going to be tough because the other pro players, they're going to be good. Um, if, if, if I don't support Ash in the way that I can, I think we could be in for a bit of, for a bit of trouble. But if Ash does his thing and I can just support him in the modus, then great. But he did miss a lot in this game. I think the game only lasted about seven minutes. And uh, yeah, I reckon before the missed doubles at the end, I reckon he was averaging... 
around 94, 95, maybe a little bit more. But yeah, he wasn't missing. I reckon he finished on about an 87, 88 average. Hello, darling. You're right. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'm good. I just finished playing. I'm on my way home. How are you? How are you? Yeah, I'm alright. Good. We just had a dinner, and she is sort of dozing or talking to Phil and Charlie. But oh, yeah, she's fair enough. Had a feed, so she'll be alright now until about midnight, and then we'll get in bed and do the normal. Oh, fair enough. Sounds good. Yeah, did you have a good time? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, yeah. I think I will be having a couple of pints next time. Yeah. That wasn't that wasn't great, completely sober. But yeah, it was all right. Who did you play? Who did I play? Um, you might have heard of him. His name's Ashley Coleman. Oh no way! Yeah, he You're fucking. Ash. I played Ash. A random draw. A random draw, and he absolutely battered me. Like he, he actually no but no but he actually played really well as well. It wasn't even like he played alright. It was like he played really, really well. That's because he didn't even play like alright, he played fucking well. Yeah. I I had a couple of good scores but uh, I didn't I didn't really get near him. Was he pleased to see you? Yeah, of course. Yeah. Looking forward to playing with him in the modus though. If he plays like that, we'll yeah. we'll win it. But uh, yeah, unfortunately, I got done by the Coleman. Not what it was the pod, the yeah. pod's done me. <laughs>